Okay, I'm at uh, Bloomfield Boulevard. Just give you a pan of the neighbors, what you're gonna be living near. That's a helicopter coming from somewhere, by the way. And here's the house coming up. Excuse my car in the front yard. Okay, so I'm gonna walk around to the other side so you can see the garage entry. Okay, I'm at the garage. Let that helicopter fly by. This is the profile of the side of the house. It's on a beautiful lake. That's your next door neighbor. And just another quick pan around the front. Beautiful yard. Okay, walking up to the front door. Got this little like patio kind of thing out the front, which is really nice. In the door, first thing you see is the lake in the background, right out there. You have the dining room, excuse me for being in the video. The phone on video kind of makes everything look a little smaller. This is a really nice sized dining room. This is the entry. And you come over here to the left, you go into the office. Very adequate office. Again, the video makes it look a little smaller than it is. Some nice detail crown on the ceiling. It looks like uh, about 12 feet, at least 12 feet, maybe more. Master bedroom. I'm gonna walk all the way over here and then pan back. You can see the bathroom over there. Overlooks the patio, lanai, the pool. It is Crystal Crete. I would say the pool's got about seven years remaining before you would want to refinish it. it. Looks like it's in overall really decent condition. This is the backyard overlooking the lake. Very private. They get you to the bathroom. Okay, we're walking toward the bathroom. We have two closets, walk-in closets. There is a ceiling access. And then you have the other closet, which is a little bit bigger. All built-ins, well done. Master bathroom. Does not have a jacuzzi tub, just a regular Roman tub, walk-in shower. Make it to the other side. Okay, we're back to the front door. Give you orientation. We're back at the dining room was on the right. We're gonna walk straight ahead to the pool area. So I'm kind of standing in the formal area. This should be the front door right here. As you come through this opening, this is a great room, very large room. vaulted ceilings. This is the dining area. It's a very nice kitchen. There is a utility room. And the garage is a three-car garage. Give you a quick little tour of the garage. Air conditioning is on. It's nice and cold in there. Just kind of give you an idea what it looks like. It looks like a Linux. Looks like it's fairly new.
and we'll go over to the guest wing. So as you come through the guest wing, you can pan to the left. There's a bedroom right back here. You've got a bedroom right here, and you have a bedroom right here. So we'll go to the first of the three. There's no lights in here, so I apologize. It feels like it's really tight. It's not. It looks like about 12 by 14, if I had to make a guess. It's the first bedroom. Here's the bathroom. It's for the guest suite. And this is the other bedroom. Super cute little cornice boards there. Nice walk-in closet. This one looks like more like uh, 12 by 12. And we're walking down into the final bedroom. It's a little bit bigger, has an ensuite bath. Nice walk-in closet. This is more like 12 by maybe 14 or 15 actually, with an ensuite bath. Guessing that this might substitute as a pool bath. And it does. So you got a little outdoor kitchen area. The pool area. The back of the house patio wise and the lake view that completes the video i hope you guys have a great day